Good freaking morning, ladies and gentlemen. I am right here. This is what? This is the Blue Bridge of Selkirk, right? We're at the Blue Bridge today. It is December 21st, and that can only mean two things. Christmas is in four days, and myself and Chris are done. Exams. Woo! No more exams. School's done for two weeks. Um, guys, this is Chris Melnick, also known, a.k.a. Gladstone, a.k.a. Gladstone. He's from... Gladstone. So I call him Gladstone. So we got Liam Schneider, who I call Schneider, and we got Chris Gladstone. So I'll probably refer to him like that. But anyway, we're on the Red River today, and we're gonna fish. We're getting everything set up. It's beautiful. My face is like numb, so if I sound a little, little different right now, my face is just numb. It's like minus 20. We got the heater going inside. No one else with us today. We're probably gonna hear car traffic all day, but yeah, hopefully get a big greenback today. First time targeting greenbacks. Wanna catch a big greenback? Yep. Yeah, I do too. So yeah, enough blibber jabber, yada yada. We're gonna get everything set up inside and then get to fishing. See you soon. Okay, we're just getting set up inside the shack. I gotta show you guys one thing first. Chris, lay up that hat for me. It was broken before, but oh no, you can't it can't be broken. Is it going now? Oh yeah. There we go. Merry Christmas. <laughs> cool. Heater going. Lights open, getting the rods set up. I still gotta get a couple things ready over here. But yeah. Are you dropping down? Yeah, that's cool. Oh yeah. That's awesome. Cool, okay. Let's, uh, I gotta get set up now and uh, let's get fishing. But you never know sometimes if it's coming in or out of the transducer beam because it's always tough to tell. Like, mm. Whatever that handle's pointed, it's facing that way. That's why you're on that side of it, I guess. But okay. You never really know. That just mount directly to the handle. Oh, I like the direct. Oh, one. there's a fish right on the bottom there. See that? Yeah. Look at that. Are you dead, bait? Just slithering in. There oh. he goes. Yeah. Check it out. Come on. Oh, he's had it in his mouth. Oh, there you go. Nice. Good one. It's got some weight. Hooked up, guys. First fish. Hey! Come here. Ah! <laughs> First green back of the season. Little spoon, live minnow. That is awesome. Hey, that's like what a 16, 17 inch fish. 17, 18, yeah. Nice. Ow, ow. Ball like gill plates, fun. Nice. That's a nice one. There it is. Ah. <laughs> Are you keeping fish today or no? Oh, I'm good. Okay, cool. This one's going back then, guys. Oh. Peace. Get skunks. Nice, yeah, no skunks <laughs> today. It barely bit though. Yeah, there you go. And, and, and. Do you see this, guys? Still got my live minnow. Reduce, reuse, recycle live minnows. Nice. Okay, well, anyway, on this rod, guys, little setup thing. Um, 39 inch medium lights, this is the drench. Uh, 10 pound braided, and then a 6 pound fluorocarbon leader. Trying out one of the uh, dinner bells today. That's the first fish I did on me. And then right here we got a 38 inch medium uh, True Grit 15 pound test and then a 12 pound floral leader with a TN70. That is what caught my biggest fish for me last year and hoping we can uh, maybe replicate that today if not uh, sometime this year too. Um, what are you using? I got a 36 medium solid carbon that I've got a gold ripping wrap on right now. Oh, there you go. Don't hook me. Right there. Ripping wrap, tried and true. They come in a whole bunch of different colors and sizes. And then you and got. Then we got another drench. Flasher jig. It's just a flasher jig. Thumper jig by Northland with a live minnow. So that is what we are starting off with today, at least. We'll see how it goes. But uh, that one just slithered in on bottom and couldn't resist. Sick. Maybe a walleye? It's big, whatever it is. Honestly, the tail looked forked. <laughs> yeah, I know it did, like a sturgeon. <laughs> oh, a sturgeon or a walleye. Catter. 
Why would a cat be that high? I don't think so. Oh my gosh, there's a mark way up there. I'm not doing anything. Oh, you're gonna drop right into him. There's two of them. Yep. Yeah. Or that's just one giant fish. One big old suspended walleye. What do you have on the a dinner the bell. bell and a oh, metal. if it smokes you? Oh my gosh, bite. Are you kidding? How is this not taking it? I don't think that's a gold eye. I don't think so either. There we go. Oh yeah. No! Oh, oh Come no! On. Right at the hole. Oh. 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 He's chasing it. Oh, he, oh my. Do no. You better set the hook on it if it bites again. Oh. Just tapped it. He never had it that time. It's still, he's still there though. Dude, he's, he's gonna hit you again. Come on. Come on. Oh my gosh. What? Oh my gosh. That did not just happen. Go. He hit you three, three times. times. I had him at the hole twice. Oh my gosh. Camera. Oh, <laughs> it's not a giant. It's not huge. But what the heck? Dude. Here we go. That's, that is freaking, right there. there that is go. freaking <laughs> awesome. Wow. Wow. That's Three a, times. That's like what, a 19 inch fish? Or give it a quick measure. Oh, 17? Oh, 18 and a half. Nice. Nice. Wow. Wow. Three times. That, <laughs> go. What the heck was that? He was literally just waiting he, underneath the ice. He kept hitting it every time I dropped. And he swam back down. He's going straight. There we go. Wow. That was nuts. Wow. That was cool. The first time he hit the hole. Like that, I lost him at the hole. <laughs> wow. 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 But we're going to do something a little bit different today. We're going to twist things up. Um, we're going to basically <laughs> provide five facts to each other that we may not know about. So we're going to Google five random facts about whatever. I'm gonna go first, then Chris is gonna go, then back and forth, and uh, maybe put a smile on your guys' faces or teach you something that you didn't know, because, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah <laughs> we're gonna start off with that. So, um, until we do the first one or we catch a fish, we will, uh, we'll see you then. I got the first one. Okay. <clears throat> Fact number one you can produce enough saliva to fill two bathtubs a year. That's a lot. That's a lot <laughs> that's of saliva. Lot. Bathtubs. Like, that's huge. <laughs> oh, that's kind of gross, too. That's a lot of damn saliva. Here, I got one. Okay. F uh, fishing one here. The word halibut means holy flatfish. Really? Apparently. Holy flatfish. Holy flatfish. Wow. Holy. That's got to be like some Latin. Something. Word or some shenanigans. Um. The average walleye can live between 15 to 20 years, and a female walleye will live around 25 years or longer. Really? Oldest, they say, is 29. Wow. That's old. So you think, guys, that's like a, you have like a 28 or 30 inch walleye, that fish is probably over 20 years old. Yeah. Easily. Especially in like Winnipeg, where the forage is so dense, they get quite a bit bigger than other lakes. Um, so that was what, fact three? I think so. Okay. Walleye are actually a part of the perch family. I didn't know that one. That's what this one oh. says, walleye facts. Walleye is a freshwater fish that belongs to the perch family. It can be found in Canada and northern parts of the USA. Walleye perch, same thing. Same species same limit. Species. Can you keep 25, <laughs> 25 part walleye because it's technically perch. Is it number five, I guess, now? Yep. Humans have 9,000 taste buds, but catfish have over 27,000. Humans have 9,000? Yeah, but catfish have over 27,000. That's three times the amount. Three times as many. That's good math. Really? Yep. 
why would they, guess, why would why would they have so many? Doesn't make any sense. I guess that's why they go for stink like bait that stinks. That's yeah, I guess. I mean, but like. They just go for bait that stinks. Yeah. Like humans are like, oh, I want my, my steak cooked medium red, <laughs> and I want my corn on the cob night. Like, you know what I mean? Oh, I'm totally fish up high. We totally, yep. totally both just missed. This is fact number six. I think so. Why is it called walleye? The torpedo shaped fish ranges from dark olive brown to yellowish gold. Its sides often mark with brazy flecks. The walleye is named for its pearlescent, pearlescent eye, which is caused by the tinctum lucidum, a reflective layer of pigment that helps the fish to see and feed at night or in turbid water. And that is actually a very cool fact, guys, because walleye see better than night, at night, than I think any species, they say. Yeah. That's why they have such big eyes, and in the morning, late at night, like, they're almost, like, not glowing, but, like, fluorescent Reflect. in a sense, because they're, well, right there, they're, tinctum lucidum is a reflective layer of pigment that helps them see early, and early morning, late at night. So yeah, science. Okay, seven. I'm looking here. So the reason why most fish have like a white belly and a darker top is so that looking from the uh, from above, they're blended into the to the ground, and then looking from underneath, they're actually they blend oh, into the sky. Oh, they're cam so they're yeah. camel because it's dark bottom, but dark it's usually bottom, bright bright top. Wow, look at that. That's that's some um, science evolution. Yeah. Keeping all these species safe. So northern pike can swim up to. 10 miles an hour. 10 miles an hour? 10 miles an hour. That's pretty quick. Yeah. For a fish that's just kicking his body and doing it. But then the fastest is a sailfish that goes up to 110. Shut up! How do you, that's what it's saying here. Is that on Wikipedia? Look it up. I'll look up some more how fast. Oh, kilometers an hour. There you go. Oh, still. Still. That's 70 crazy. miles Crazy. Jeez. Fast one. Cool. Female largemouth bass produce an average of 4,000 eggs per pound of body weight. So like a four pound bass would be 16,000. No, we're, we're both drunk. Oh no, you're right. Oh, that's right. Yeah, four yeah, times four, four. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's funny you went with that one because this is the one I did. Okay, 10th fact. While I spawn roughly uh, 100,000 eggs, which hatch in about two weeks and a walleye lives between yeah, 14, 10 to 14 years on average, but so 100,000 eggs for a walleye, and they hatch in about two weeks, and you're say 16,000. Oh, for a four pound. for a four pound one, and they hatch in a week. Uh, didn't say how long. Hmm. We have no idea if no. any of these facts are true, by the way. We're just going off. We're just going off the Google, the Google. But hey, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy uh, 10 facts. About everything that's fishing related, I think, right? No, nope. no, nope. nope. I had ice the, glaciers. There was the bathtub one. All oh, right, yeah. <laughs> right. <laughs> Stupid. Yeah. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, we're gonna try to catch some more fish now. So, yeah, stay tuned. There's a small one on me. I'm my dead sick. Yep. On. Nice. Saugerville. Is that cool seeing it on the live show come up though? Like yeah. Pull them up as you go. Oh, I still have my minnow down there too. <laughs> if we were looking to keep some sauger today, none of these would be legal size, so we wouldn't have done that either. But hey, okay. cool. Like it. That is gonna grow to be a 40 incher one day, or I mean 40 centimeter. That's what I mean. And this minnow is is barely holding on, but we're uh, we're still gonna give it a whirl. Back for another one. Bottom. Oh. Oh, there we go. Ooh. Drag loose or just nice fish? I don't know. It's decent. I'll grab my. This one? Yeah, there we go. It's not bad. That one's on bottom, too. We got a hole grab him or you get. Oh, dude, bubbles. Oh, hey, there mind. you go. Not there you go. Hey, that rod is just so soft. That's awesome. That's the third walleye today, third folks. Third walleye. Third one. <laughs> not gonna do, but not gonna make it as far. There you go. Come on, man. I'm on my fourth fish with mine. <laughs> cool. Come on. Awesome. There it is. And Another one going back. Back in the hole. We're not keeping today. We'll leave that for another day. We had fish the other week and it was delicious. So. There we go. Cool. Solid go. fish, dude. Okay. Merry Christmas. That is gonna wrap it up today.
for us on the river. It was it was a solid day. We caught some fish. Um, nice to get out. It wasn't windy. Everything works inside the tent. And uh, we got my first wall of the season. You should get that fish right now. Oh, he might he might get this right on camera. Come on. That's been happening all day today. They were not aggressive to say the least, no. um, but it's okay. We caught some fish, we had some fun. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, as usual, my guest host, would you like to say anything to the people of YouTube? Make sure you like and subscribe. Nice, hey, cool, didn't even, didn't even pay him to say that. So yeah, like and subscribe, and we will see you guys in the next episode of Mantle with Fishing Adventures. Peace.